Hello, yes, this is the game with the bat and the man. Some call him Batman, but I do not, because I call him Guy. Your first test as Guy is to get past the screen. I spent 30 minutes not pressing anything before realising it was in fact a loading screen, but I'm dumb. In this game, you can repeatedly walk into the same guard and he'll hit you, but it's your fault because you weren't being polite. Learn manners. The first boss fight is this dumpster. You have to dodge his attacks and not get not hit by his attacks by evading it. It's pretty difficult, but I believe in you. Once you defeat the dumpster, you unlock the ability to ruin birthday parties. This is the defining feature of this game. The game, though, is flawed because it doesn't tell you what buttons to press. You have to figure it out by yourself. I mean, look, that's pretty much impossible. No clues whatsoever. I don't know why Guy needs to use a helicopter to go places. He has pretty legs for moving. <coughs> this game has an excellent combat system. It is challenging because the AI constantly throw punches at you and you're expected to dodge them all. So yeah. But being from England, I don't own any doors, so I was pleased to see that this game has a door simulator, which allows me to fulfil my fantasies. You could say the game hinges on this. <laughs> yeah. So, to being make a conclusion, if you're like me and you like getting beaten up by hyper-masculine men for pleasure, then this game is probably for you. Hey, Max, come here, I've got some ammo, turn around. Oh, that freak. Or these people all get oh, a bull in their heads.